Isn't that illegal? I've had an idea. I've had an idea that God might have more followers in the following scenario. Okay? Bear with me. The Bible says, worst of this effect, worship God, believe in God, and you'll go to heaven. Sounds great. Sounds good so far? Good deal. What if the Bible also said, if you don't worship me, you'll just, you'll not go to heaven, but I'll not do anything to you. You'll just die. That'll be the end of you. You'll cease to exist. Okay? No big deal. That's what atheists believe will happen anyway. That's all fine. So it'll all be, you know, take heaven, leave heaven. You're not going to suffer. You're not going to... You just lose heaven. That's the deal. That's the the deal that you make. Fortunately, the situation at the moment is what Christians now believe is that uh, yeah, worship God, believe in God, you go to heaven. That's good. It's cool. Fine. That's what you want to do. You go to heaven. Have a great time. However, if you don't worship God, you burn in hell in eternal in internal torment in a lake of fire <laughs> now that's the part that doesn't sound so good follow me or else in other words it's a threat and I think that any religion that relies on threatening abusive and it is abusive follow me or you will be punished abusive behaviour like that is wrong you wouldn't get married to someone and say I promise to love you and honour you, be faithful to you, uh, but if you step out of line, I'll hack you to bits, torture you with rusty razor blades. That's the deal. <laughs> That's not love. Is that love? That's not love. Another example. Um, evil dictators. Plenty of them about. Plenty of them in history. What do they do when people don't agree with them? They put all the dissenters to death. Maybe torture them, torture their relatives, torture their friends. But basically the dissenters are put to death for not obeying. Sounds familiar? Sounds a bit like God sending uh, someone to hell for not being a faithful servant. Sounds exactly like that. God sends people to hell if you do not follow God. And that's one of the... Um, principal teachings of, the, of Christianity love God you go to heaven if not God himself will send you to hell God made hell he'll send you there so God, God doesn't love you God loves you when you love him if you don't love God God hates you God will hate you God will punish you he doesn't like it when you don't do what he says he will punish you if you don't serve him is that a good God? Is that a loving God? Or is that a vindictive, nasty, evil God? I don't have to give you that answer. You know what the answer is. Isn't that illegal? Censor your kids' ideas. Censor your child's inspiration. Censor all that. Expect a really heavy return spring, because you know what? That kid's going to turn around yet, and you're never, ever going to have a part of his life again. Casting off the chains of the world. But enough about me.